Good morning from the floor of the CME. This is Chris Robinson with your traders exclusive comment here today, Tuesday the 8th, getting ready for the USDA report tomorrow on the grains. What are we watching there? Well, I've talked before about how these reports can give you opportunity. That's what this is giving you now. Um, just yesterday, we had a nice rally uh, capped off with a six week high in soybeans. Soybeans rallied 65 cents from the last USDA report. A lot of people were short in the hole, including the funds. This rally was mostly driven by a short covering rally. That's when losers are buying back their shorts. That's driving the market higher. Yesterday, we saw a bit of a, a, a what looked like a capitulation, throw in the towel type of day. We went up to six week highs and then broke. How much of a break did we have? I talk a lot about technicals. The market rallied 65 or to 67 cents. Between yesterday's high and today's low, we've come back halfway. Look at that, that 50% retracement. A lot of people watch it, bulls and bears. So very technical trade in, in beans. Uh, moving on to the corn. The corn's been in a narrow trading range. We, what took three and a half weeks, we rallied 18 cents. Yesterday, we turned around and dropped 11. So again, we go up the escalator and we go down the elevator shaft uh, in these grains. Uh, we're really watching what's going on in the wheat. The, the, the wheat had tried to make a, 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 a bit of a rally. Uh, in three days, it rallied 30 cents, and then it started to also leak with uh, the soybeans pulling us lower. What we're focused on tomorrow is carryouts. I'm not gonna go over what the carryouts are. You can look that up yourself, what the anticipated carryouts are. If the carryouts are out of whack for soybeans and corn, you're gonna get a move. Uh, if not, we may just see typical uh, December choppy trade. Uh, that's really about it. I think that's tomorrow at 11 o'clock, you're going to get a little bit of opportunity in the grains uh, to take care of uh, 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 if, there is some, if, if there is some follow through. Here's the, the, the last thing. I didn't mean to forget about this. The funds. The funds are all short. They're short about 80,000 corn, 70,000 wheat, and about 30,000 soybeans. If for some reason the number comes out tomorrow and it's very bullish, you could see another leg up uh, fueled by short covering. From the floor of the CME, this is Chris Robinson. Hope you have a good day tomorrow. Hope you make some dough.